Well, this is this is it. This is what I've come up with. <laughs> it's it's um, really simple, and it's just a your normal typical um, paint stripper. Um, just blow, blows out extremely hot air, and all I've done is um, <laughs> is uh, I've, I had an old soldering iron. Uh, I took this part off the soldering iron, and there was three hot screw holes in it there and I've just basically uh, screwed some screws straight through uh, into there and it holds it nice and tight um, and obviously the hot air comes out here most of the hot air blows out of these little holes there there can you see there um, but obviously some most of it does go down here and out the little tube there and this actually re works really well. I've seen a lot of other ways of people making these. Um, not using one of these though. Um, and then they just kept failing. Um, this works perfectly. And um, I fixed um, a mobile phone uh, charge port on the old Blackberries with this. Um, and you can um, you can do lots of stuff with this. Um, if if you do a lot of soldering like I do, um, you, there will become a point where you need to use um, um, hot air soldering because there's not enough room to get soldering iron in um, so this is perfect it's nice and cheap um, you've probably already got one of these laying around and you've probably already got a couple of dead soldering irons as well um, I will post in the um, description in fact I'll just put a little picture up on this video now to show you what soldering iron I used for this part and I'll also um, put up a picture of this because this has got some uh, tape on it um, this tape is doing nothing I stuck it on there for a, a different project as you can see uh, I just can't be bothered to take it off so yeah all I've basically done is um, I've taken this off an old soldering iron um, and uh, s screwed it in put some screw holes in there straight into there and uh, I'll just cut to a video now uh, showing uh, me using this. Anyway. Yeah, yeah. 